Today we're going to take this laptop and this guitar pedal, combine them together and create an awesome mobile guitar rig. Dialing in a good sound inside of a room that is treated or that you've created DIY treatment for is a lot easier than actually going outdoors or taking your rig elsewhere to get great tones. And that's where really some great affordable hardware integrated with some mobile recording laptop or something of that nature, or even your phone these days, can do a really good job of capturing great tones regardless of where you're at. Now, one of the benefits of this is because that most of the sounds are contained within the guitar pedal itself, you don't have to worry about the issues of your room being treated at all. In fact, you could make some great recordings in a noisy atmosphere and still get a really good take. Let's take a closer look at this 16 inch Notebook Pro G laptop. It's designed to make your computing experiences easy and enjoyable. First, it's built to last with a strong alloy chassis and the 16 inch screen offers clear and smooth visuals for work or even for play. Now inside, the Intel Core i7 keeps things running smoothly even when multitasking. Gamers and creatives alike will love the NVIDIA RTX 3060 GPU for fantastic graphics as well. And if you're worried about space or speed, there's no need to be worried at all. In fact, you can add up to 64 gigs of RAM and two different storage drives. It's slim, lightweight, and customizable to fit your style. And one of the awesome things about this company that sets it apart from the others are also the customization options that you get. For instance, you can have your logo put on the cover of the laptop, and on top of that, there's no bloatware, so you don't have to worry about some kind of a Best Buy app being on there that shouldn't be on there, or some other intrusive Norton antivirus that keeps popping up wanting you to pay money for it. It's literally just a powerhouse, bare-bones computer with exactly what you need, as well as the drives already partitioned to a way that makes sense for you. Now, if you were to get the same laptop that I have with all the specs that are included, 64 gigs of RAM, two terabytes worth of SSD, as well as the Intel Core i7, you're gonna be paying probably over $3,000 for this laptop. However, if you get your laptop from the Creative Devices team, you're looking at half the price of market value. I've had this laptop now for over a month, and I have to say it's been running smooth, it's been running great, and literally it is a powerhouse. I can actually edit 4K video on this thing flawlessly. Now, the second core element of this setup is the guitar pedal itself. I've chosen to use the Tonex guitar pedal because of its affordability and also because of its versatility. Now, because the content of today's video is more about taking these two core elements, putting them together, and hearing the results that you're gonna get, I'm not gonna be doing a deep dive on the Tonex pedal or on the laptop itself. I will talk about some of the specs and some of the reasons why this would benefit, but if you'd like to see a more in-depth review on the controls or how to use either one of these objects, please leave a comment in the comment section down below and let me know about that. The Tonex pedal by IK Multimedia utilizes cutting edge AI machine modeling technology, delivering up to 150 studio grade tone model presets at your fingertips. Essentially, it's like having the world's most comprehensive studio guitar locker in a portable pedal format, complete with replicas of sought after amplifiers, pedals, cabinets, and even full size rigs. Additionally, you can expand your tonal options by downloading unlimited free user models. What sets the Tonex pedal apart is its user-friendly design, making it ideal for performing musicians. Likewise, it features a straightforward control layout with three foot switches for quick preset selection, intuitive knobs for tweaking, and an easy to read screen. Also, no computer is required to access your Tonex models, allowing you to seamlessly transition from the studio to the stage. Now, furthermore, the Tonex pedal doubles as a USB audio interface, enabling you to record studio quality guitar tracks directly into your preferred DAW. And it even includes a headphone jack for convenient direct monitoring, making it an excellent noise-free practice companion. In summary, the Tonex pedal by IK Multimedia offers a comprehensive solution for musicians looking to bring the studio quality sound of Tonex to their live performances and recording sessions all in a single, compact, and user-friendly pedal format. Okay, so here's a really cool thing about this whole setup. So just by simply opening up the laptop itself, I'll turn this on, and then just a very few amount of cables are required. So obviously you have your plug-in, your nine volt power supply, then we have our 
USB cable here and our USB input on the back of the pedal itself. So the wonderful thing about this particular Tonex pedal, and this is part of the versatility I was talking about, was that now that the Tonex pedal is connected to the laptop, it's not just a pedal, it's also an interface. So I can actually listen to anything that I record in real time and play it back as well through the pedal itself. So by connecting a set of headphones, I've now got the mobility option of just one set of headphones, one audio interface, that being the pedal itself, and then the laptop. So as you can see, it's really starting to narrow down everything in the sense of what's required uh, for mobile recording. So now speaking of the versatility, I can actually just put the Tonex in the effects band here on my guitar channel and treat it like a VST plugin. So that therefore, by opening it up, I have access now to ToneNet and all of the other amp settings that I might have. Now in terms of versatility, again, this is where we can set up the Tonex pedal to actually record just a dry DI source and yet I'll be hearing it through an amp source here and then I can go back and choose any one of the amps within the ToneNet models and get an infinite amount of possibilities. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the Tonex into a different mode. As of right now, it's in live mode. So I'm going to go to global setup, switch over to operation. So right now it's in live mode. I'm going to switch that to interface mode. And in my USB out, I'm going to switch that to dual. So by setting it up this way, essentially what I'm doing is I'm taking a clean DI signal as well as the amp recorded signal. Both of them will be in mono and then I'll be able to uh, get a imprint from both of those at the same time. Okay, so now on the track above here, I have the DI signal. On the track below, I have the amp signal. Let's say I don't need that option of recording the DI signal and the amp signal, however. I can just go in here and select stereo, switch the mode on the Tonex pedal. Okay, so by now that I've switched to live, I'm gonna also switch the mode here from dual back to stereo. So this will give me a stereo recording of whatever it is that I'm playing through. So now with all of that being said, that means the stereo reverb effects that are in here, as well as the um, depth that I get from the depth setting that's on the pedal itself is going to be in real time in stereo. So it's going to sound really, really good. 